The car of tomorrow could be the car of revenge today. Fox Sports welcoming you to Martinsville, Virginia. NASCAR's oldest track and its shortest track. We'll have no trouble, though, tracking points leader Jeff Gordon. Last year's winner is here, Tony Stewart. And the home state kid, the pole sitter today, Denny Hamlin. From the Hollywood Hotel, we bring you closer to the races where America gathers every weekend for NASCAR, Darrell Waltrip, Jeff Hammond, I'm Chris Myers, and we thank you for being with us. Hope you're having a great weekend. I'm here with a couple of April Fools. Oh, oh come on, I can't. All right, all hey, right. We're only a fool for one day. Yeah. What's your right. excuse? You asked me, he, he asked me what month <laughs> April Fools was in. All right, I'm kidding. All right, so the car tomorrow, second race here at the Martinsville. What about the driver adjustments? You know what, Chris, the thing about short tracks, Bristol, Martinsville, it's not about cars. It's about drivers. It's about guys that can finesse the gas and work the wheel. I don't know what all this complaint about the car is, particularly at Martinsville and Bristol. Uh, Jeff, what about NASCAR, the adjustments? Have they made any for this race? Well, they had to work on a few things. Num most notably, it has to be the exhaust pipes. They found out after Bristol that some of them had broken. Guys got some gas fumes from carbon monoxide up inside the car. They had to make those thicker this week, as well as maybe a little bit of adjustments to some of the tolerances. They learned a lot from last week at Bristol of what this new car is going to be giving them as far as difficulties as far as they're concerned. And we welcome you back to the small town of Martinsville in South Central Virginia with a chance of rain today. Scattered showers. We hope they scatter away from here. Temperature in the 60s could reach the 70s. The winds are calm. Jeff Gordon, a seven-time winner, points leader. Chasing him is Carl Edwards with a slick look. Currently 10th in points. His best finish here at the Martinsville Speedway is 12th. The 117th Martinsville race, and we head trackside. Race fans, today's colors presented by the Virginia National Guard. For our invocation today from Raceway Ministries, Tim Bird. Heavenly Father, as we come before you today, we are humbled by your mercy and grace given to us despite our weakness, and give thanks for the blessings of freedom made possible by the sacrifices of many. As we pause before the start of this event, we pray for the safety of each driver, crew member, official, and spectator. And for this day and each day to come, may you receive the praise, honor, and glory for who you are and will always be. And it's in your name we pray, amen. Today's national anthem is performed by B.J. Norris, director of music, Martinsville Middle School. fans, two F-16s from Lackland Air Force. They're really well done, and the drivers hope to do the same. We'll talk with one of Virginia's native sons when we continue. You're watching NASCAR on Fox.